guys, today we're gonna make this cabinet featuring Arabic pattern the sliding doors. Nice. But first I wanna thank Inventables for sponsoring this project. First I'm gonna build the wooden cabinet and then we'll do the doors. Of course I screwed up the other side of the door, so I made an insert piece and I'm gonna glue it. Now that this is done, let's focus on the other doors. So I'm gonna have the X-Carve doing all the hard work here. So before I get to this in Excel, I actually need to design the part and import it so that the X-Carve can do the magic, you know? Um, so let's start from the beginning. Um, there are thousands of possible patterns. So I have a couple of pictures of the one I like and it shouldn't be very hard to replicate in Fusion 360 and then... Actually, it is hard. So what I'm gonna do is try to find the simplest cell of this pattern and then mirror it and replicate it and so that I can build the whole door. 
So if I take this picture, which is quite clear, we can throw some rulers on the symmetry lines and actually start to see what could be that cell. And I think this is the cell. So if I crop it, you can see that it's just part of a 10-point star and a couple of 5-point stars and the other part of a 10-point star. This should be simple to build in, in Fusion, so that's what I did. And then it's just a matter of applying an offset to give volume to this sketch. Then you mirror it and replicate it and there you go, you have the whole lore. So as soon as I had completed the door, I found a video on YouTube about how these patterns are generated mathematically that could have saved me like hours of work but you know that's that's life if you are interested i'll leave a link in the description anyway i'm importing this design into easel so let's go back to the shop and let the x carve do all the work yeah. and by the way if you want to know more about the x carve i'm leaving a few links in the description Of course, I had to mess up something. You know, the X-Carve is super accurate, but you have to make sure that you fit it the right dimensions. I didn't check when I imported the file. Okay, this was a test. Now, this should be the right size. Now, yeah, much better. Let me hang this on the wall and I'll show you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>